Hey everybody, it's me, Leo, currently. Okay, let's get started from last night's highlights. Day 27 was Gemma's 35th birthday, and Gemma is still asleep. John finds out the house has no hot water. Stephanie said that the previous night that she wanted the housemates to vote for her so she could be with Jeremy. John said that Gemma could have a stinky weave for her birthday, like as a joke. Housemates couldn't remember what Steph said. Big Brother aired it out, though, of course. Tiffany had a full-blown orgasm in bed the previous night also. Big Brother gives Gemma a happy birthday message. The rest of the house give, is given a test to give Gemma the best birthday ever by making it the worst birthday ever. When treats come to the house, it is the goal of the housemates to sabotage said treats. So on and so forth. They have to, housemates have to refrain from celebrating, and they must make 35 feel very old to Gemma. Gemma removes her microphone in protest of no hot water after she leaves the diary room. She said that she won't prevent, perform for them and spend the day in the toilet. Gemma then decides to take a cold shower after 30 minutes in the toilet. And then here's nominations. We already know Danielle has been nominated for tonight's eviction so far, but here's Here's what happened. Stephanie nominates Darren because he didn't have her back with Daniela's comment, and John because of his bitching and two-facedness with Gemma. John nominates Steph Gemma for because of all of her contradictions, and she doesn't really take responsibility. Stephanie because she doesn't want to hear how much she misses Jeremy. Sky AT nominates Gemma because of her not wanting to perform, and Stephanie because she is untidy and hasn't washed her clothes in days. And then, um, after Scotty T does his nomination, then we see Jenna take, taking a shower. Next up is Tiffany saying that Scotty T, Scotty T, because this is, this is my favorite way, this is how you should nominate. Tiffany feels Scotty T as competition, which is true. Yeah, Tiffany, <clears throat> Tiffany nominated the right way, I think. Which is, you nominate because you see, you see competition in this person. And then Tiffany nominated Darren because she's sick and tired of Darren avoiding her. Darren nominates Tiffany because he feels uncomfortable with her and he's afraid of how unpredictable she gets when she's drunk. Gemma, Darren nominates Gemma because the, his situation with John was magnified thanks to Gemma. Like, Gemma stirred the pot in that one. Gemma nominated Stephanie because of her immaturity against Daniela, and John because he gets grouchy when housemates wants to have fun in the bedroom. Saying, like, being in the Big Brother house, like, sleeping in the bedroom is just, like, a sleepover kind of thing. Which is true. Finally, Daniela got to vote. Daniela told Tiffany because she's afraid when Tiffany gets goes off, and Stephanie because she feels bad for what she said to her, but gets she got mad when Stephanie retorted. So facing eviction tonight are Gemma, Stephanie, and Daniela. The secret mission starts. Stephanie and Sky T got their drinks on. They drank the brandy shots that were meant for Gemma. Storeroom food fight. Um, a la BBUK storeroom rebellion. Um, with uh, Darren and. John throwing food at each, throwing all the cakes and snacks at each other. Gemma feels unfazed by it, but at this point, Tiffany does a birthday speech to Gemma about Tiffany. <laughs> and Tiffany was like, she knew she was born for greatness and shit like that. And then Darren must convince that he chose three music tracks. It w there were three music tracks sung by Darren when he had, like, a record contract or something like that, 
save the day from a musical in the country by a music from a musical and beautiful city from another musical. <laughs> Darren felt embarrassed by the tracks and he knew the tracks could bite him in the how bite him in the ass. I don't think Gar Darren liked his re recording career. And Gemma seems happy. <laughs> Scotty T throws Gemma's birthday cake in the garden. And Scotty T's reasoning was that birthday cake was shit. Big Brother lets Gemma in on the mission. Gemma, since housemates ruined it, Gemma gets to win delicious cocktails, a pamper session. Pink, the pink fluffy phone from the shopping desk and a professional Essex blow dry from an Essex hairstylist. And she was really excited for that because she was just like, just, I don't care about the pink fluffy phone, but I got my Essex blow dry. The acrylic nail thing from an Essex <laughs> nail stylist. A selection of cards from friends and family and a 15 minute session with a mini pony in the garden. After receiving her Essex blow dry, Gemma gets 50, her 15 minutes with a pon mini pony. Gemma wants a mini pony just to take around Essex with her. And the pony that they got is from Essex too. <laughs> it's like living in Essex. During Gemma's birthday party, Scotty T and Tiffany get kind of close. Scotty T could bone Christina if she were single. Tiffany wants Scotty to kiss her the way she was kissed during the Truth or Dare game. And then Scotty T has an epiphany after the party, and he was like, I think Tiffany wants to molest me. He said it like that. <laughs> it was hilarious. Tiffany talks to herself, and she says that little boys play with, play with her and don't deliver. A man would, would have delivered front, side, left, and behind. And they would get wet for her. That's what she said. She's not going to beg for Scotty T again. Um, she's done with the boys in the house. She she wants the dick to come to her instead of her fighting the dick. Tiffany wants to play around with him, though, still. But, I mean, like, for penis and shit, she wants the penis to come to her and, like, you know, tonguing and shit like that. John teaches Darren how to walk in Gemma's heel, like, walking heels in Gemma's shoes. So Darren is wearing Gemma's shoes and walking in heels. And I think Darren should do one of those walks where men wear high heels in solidarity of, fem solidarity of feminism. Gemma, her, her words on her birthday was that it was bizarre and she was happy and amazed. And it was a proper turnout to her. Scotty T in the diary room, he's just giving Tiffany banter at this point. Okay, I don't know what... And then let's get onto Ben on the side. The uh, panel has said that John knows what game he's playing. We kind of know what game he's playing. He's trying to make himself stay until the final. The housemates now think she can be a... Oh, think that Tiffany can be a front runner now. Which is true. Which is true. She's the last remaining American in the house. Some exclusives. Tiffany said in the diary room that her vagina was was crying at like when they showed the footage of the party. John McCreary was on the panel and he asked Jeremy if Stephanie would have done the same thing to Sam Reese to Jeremy. The thing is though was Stephanie and Jeremy actually fell in love in the house. That was the thing. Some exclusives. Housemates who are up for eviction. Housemates are no are let in and known who are up for eviction, and we get to show that in tonight's highlights. Tiffany knows her competition is Scotty T, and she knows she's going to win. Another exclusive is Stephanie is assigned tests. Stephanie has assigned tests to housemates to do in the diary room. And I think who's next to be evicted is Stephanie. I wanted John to go really badly, but since John isn't nominated... I don't think John's going to win, but I know that I think Stephanie is going to be evicted, though. Okay, so that is it for now. Tonight's eviction, I'll, I'll come back with you to you tomorrow with tonight's, evi with tonight's eviction. So see ya!